So this is the Seagull Theatre. We're a community-led arts venue uh, here in Lowestoft where we specialise in providing a range of support services for our local community. So we've put up a lot of additional shielding, um, particularly in between the seating areas to make sure that when we have a household around a particular table or an individual, they're not able to, they're not going to be coming into direct contact with people at other close by tables. We've spent a considerable amount of time going through and creating a, a detailed risk assessment for all of the different activities that we have here in the theatre and doing that process has been really useful in identifying some areas that were perhaps hotspots. So the process of becoming COVID secure was really about taking the time to understand the requirements. It wasn't particularly onerous or particularly expensive. There was some expense in, in buying sanitizer and, and providing the signage around the building. We really enjoyed the opportunity to support our local community and, and that's what the building is about. So as, even when, the, when we weren't able to physically open the building, we were still taking supportive actions. We had a telephone tree, we did some shopping for people, we were out there trying to maintain contact with our local residents. It's obviously been a really difficult year for the arts and for, for, for community venues like ours. But ironically, it's also reinforced how important we are. I think having us not here for periods of time and having to close for periods of time, if anything, has reminded uh, our community and reminded the, the country as a whole um, how important the arts are, how important community arts are, how much they benefit people's well-being, how much they contribute to a, a safe and happy and healthy uh, community and society. We're really positive, we're really looking forward to, to getting back out there and having more people in the building.